This is an animal cell, and the big circle around it is the plasma membrane, which protects and regulates what comes in and what goes out of the cell. This purple circle is the nucleus, which stores the cell's DNA and controls all the cellular functions. This purple dot inside of the nucleus is the nucleolus, and it helps in protein synthesis and production of ribosomes. These things outside of the nucleolus is called the chromatin and it compresses the DNA tightly so it can fit inside the nucleus. The orange things are the mitochondria which is the powerhouse of the cell because they produce ATP which is the energy that a cell needs. These are the rough endoplasmic reticulum which produces proteins for the rest of the cell to function. These are the smooth endoplasmic reticulum which makes lipids makes steroid hormones and detoxes harmful byproducts from out the cell these are the golgi apparatus which receives proteins from the er and moves them to where they need to go these red circles are the lysosomes which is the digestive system of the cell it breaks down and digests the macromolecules in the cell repairs the cell membrane and responds against foreign substances like bacteria and viruses these green circles are the peroxisomes and they break down toxic materials in the cell in the essay questions are in the context of cell biology what do we mean by a form follows function and that means like the shape and form of a structure is linked to the function of that structure for example the nucleus is round so it can hold all the dna and everything else that it's supposed to hold and it holds it nicely Another example are the peroxisomes. They're sacs that um, basically break down the toxins in the cell and the, the sac holds the toxins so it can break it everything down. And that's it, bye.